Now, I know, I know I'm pretty confusing. I'm playing some more We Party Globe Trot. This is already our fourth video on it, but I am only to standard difficulty because it's been incredibly hard. So now suddenly you'll notice that I have all the difficulties unlocked. The last three videos, I did not have all the difficulties unlocked. That's because I was playing on my Wii U the previous three videos. And today I am playing on my Wii. That's why I said I'm confusing. I go back and forth between consoles. I mean, they all play the same game, but I have different things unlocked on each. It would definitely be an easier thing to do to just stay on the same console the whole time, but that's just, I, I don't know. I it, it My Wii is plugged in. It, it plays the same game. However, I don't have, the last time we played, I unlocked Spot the Sneak. I've never unlocked that on this Wii. Here's what we're gonna do. Helen, we definitely played against Helen. I'm gonna do three cycles, whatever we land on, we, we, we play. So there's one, there's two, and there's three. No, I don't like them. There's four. No, I don't like them. Five. No, I don't like them. I don't like Helen. But should I play against Helen? Because I hate Helen. Okay, hold up. New rule, three more, and then whoever, and this time, I'm for reals. So one, two, three. Man, I do, I don't, Megan, I don't like this uh, lineup either, but. I, I can spend all day just going through the me's and looking at them and not feeling quite uh, satisfied with who they are. So if you haven't watched this series before, it is only three videos long so far. This is the fourth. Globetrot is not Board Game Island. In Globetrot, you go around the world. It is a much bigger board, and it is much more rigged. That is the conclusions I've came to on this. So those are our first three postcards to get. You win at the end whoever has the most postcards plus coins. It's a lot more like Mario Party, or most Mario Party games where you collect stars and coins. You need 10 coins to buy the stars. It's the same concept. Coins are used in tiebreakers. What the important thing to get is, uh-oh. Ooh! No! Ah! <laughs> why did Ian, why did Ian not shoot me? And why did I, I, I fricked myself so hard there. Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're dead. Wow, Ian, you didn't kill me in the beginning for whatever reason, and it came back to bite you because I did not show you any mercy. So in mini games, when you win them, you get 10 coins, which helps your travel endeavors. You can only go three freaking spaces uh, at most from the cards, which sucks. That's why you need to buy cards, better cards. Of course, I picked the one. Uh, I'm gonna go towards the exclamation pointy. Um, we can get a good surprise here, or we can get a bad one. We'll see. Bad one. Perfect. This is, this is, I think this is the second time in a row. The last game I played, same damn thing happens. I get the UFO first on this space, and I go right back. So I just gave Megan a free space. Megan. The first three points of interest, the first three postcards, never seem to be in my in my capabilities of getting. These people suck at soccer. They're really bad at soccer. What? Well, it doesn't matter, but I would have liked to get all five just for my own, my own sake. The UFO Armada. Three of us are on one spot and you're on another. So this is not gonna be very much of a shakeup. Ian ends up there, which was guaranteed. I end up not there yet. No, nope, no, nope. I'm not the one person that gets a free space. Have I ever told you I hate babies? In my crying Wii remote? I can't, I can't. I don't understand. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I almost, I almost figured out this stupid fucking thing. You stupid baby, stop crying. Let me win. Let me win. You're trying to make me not win right now. You're trying to make me not win. Come on! You're such a stupid crying piece of shit. Let me fucking win! 
Oh my god. I I could never be a, I could never deal with it. I would punt it. I think I can get to uh, Japan before Abe now. Well, Abe just spent all his money, so he can't even afford Japan. No, not me. Don't UFO me, please. Ooh. Actually, I don't want this. I don't want the balloons. Balloons are... <sighs> Usually, I want that. But with my card layout right now, I had I had to get... I guaranteed had Japan with the cards I had. Now, I don't. Now, I just have random numbers every fucking time. Ian, you're a piece of shit. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, seven. <laughs> Seven's the number I'm going for. I would have had it, but I freaking forgot what I was counting to. I was going to use my taxi cab card to get a three or a two so I could go right to Japan. But now I have to use a balloon card and get a random number. Four. Perfect. I can't get there now. Wait. No, I can't. <laughs> How fucking fantastic. And then when I, now when I move there, I don't know what to do. I actually don't know what to do. Suck my actual balls. I don't know what to do. I'm going for the surprise. Maybe I can get rid of these cards. I don't know. I was going to have Japan, but now I didn't. Yeah, boy. Well, here we go. Now we're not even going to be here anymore. Okay, this... This is so far shaping out to be the most chaotic game of... Okay, I go to the furthest fucking space away. He, uh, he has a six and eight. So he probably can use that eight to get to one of them. I'm guessing. I don't... I don't... Why the f*** did you just go all the way to mother Africa to do a 1v3? Abe... What? Oh, he doesn't have enough coins for the damn, for the hotspot. So I guess his logic was to go to Africa. Abe is not a good counter. So she, Megan's gonna get India. Uh, that's definitely not India. That's Singapore. Lucky you, Megan. Typical Megan fashion. So now Ian can pull. He can get this one. Of course. Out of the <laughs> lowest odds of that number to get the one, but he got the one. <laughs> there goes Japan. Oh, fuck me, dude. I'm I am I am so I used to be so good at this and now I am just poopy. Ah! Where did my pointer go? Hello! That was not even my fault. And I got last place thanks to that. He got, I'm, I'm, I'm just sitting here not thinking about much, looking at my screen mindlessly before I realized that Abe just got India. So I have officially lost out on all three of those spots. Germany and eat sausages. Yeah, I'll freaking gladly go to Germany and eat some sausages. Morocco and eat some freaking diarrhea. And Egypt and eat some roast squab, whatever the hell that is. I might as well use my balloon and see where the hell we end up. We're actually only eight spaces away from Morocco. Since when is Alaska eight spaces from Morocco in Africa? I'm so good at chopping carrots. I am three spaces away from Morocco. I could just use... Yeah, why don't I do that? I'll just use my three. One of my three cards, because they were both threes. And get to Morocco and eat whatever the frick this hell... Frick this hell food is. What is what was it? It was it was something brown and liquidy. That's all I remember. Well Coscus. Wait, it's actually tiny pasta. Huh. It isn't diarrhea after all. It wasn't even a liquid dish. It was pretty solid. I got another three card. Am I three away from Germany as well? If I'm Three away from Germany as well. I'm about to sweep the freaking competition. What is that card in the middle? It's like this this one right here. What is this card? <laughs> stomach ache. Somebody's got an upset stomach. And what? What happens to them? It must have been something you ate, Ian. <laughs> the you got a shit card. What does it do? What does the 
effect of that? Ian's got his shit now, but what? What's the consequence? Like, what? How does that impact the game? What? what like, what happened? I couldn't read it quick enough to, as to... <laughs> he has an stomach. And is resting for one turn. You lose a turn if you get diarrhea. <laughs> That's accurate. You miss out on life when you gotta spend it on the toilet. Trust me, I know that. I shit a lot. No, I'm going straight. I'm avoiding what they're... Oh. I try to take the path less... Take... The, Travel by the path, the path less, I, I, two roads diverged in a yellow wood, and I, I chose the one less traveled, and I got fucked because of it. I'm pretty sure I've, I've, uh, tried to recite that poem before on a video, and I can't remember what the situation was, but this was another situation in which it's applicable. Oh, God damn it, Abe. Abe got to Egypt before me. Not sure how, I was looking at my phone. How far, Germany is four, so I gotta get lucky. And I almost get lucky, I get a three. I have three cards and I get a three from the balloons. If I can end up at a space three away, that would be most ideal. But I don't think I can. I gotta, I, I'm gonna go to Surprise Island up here, I don't. I don't know what else. I think I'm in potato land over here. Is this where Ireland is? I don't know. But, ah, crap. Now everyone's gonna be over here. Uh, oh wait, no, everyone's gonna be at Abe's spot. Okay, well, uh, this changes everything. Now how far from Germany am I? I don't know. The game is almost over. We are getting these uh, hot spots way quicker than usual this game But I am not doing good. I'm, I'm doing average. This is usually how it goes. I'm never really in the lead. Okay smile everybody I need lots of smiles. The music is the best part of the last few turns We're gonna have to hope for a five if We can finally get what we want for once Of course not. We're gonna get a seven. Maybe seven can get us there somehow as well? No. Okay, hold up, but we can end up here, which then allows us to draw our three to get to Germany. Poopy butts, dude. I wanted to get rid of my balloon, not the... Watch this, that eight's probably gonna get her to Germany. Actually, no, I don't think it can. I don't know where she's going. She's going back to North America. How close is that? I don't think eh, it's not gonna get him there, but it's gonna get him really close. We cannot lose to Ian this next mini game, or else he's getting there. Very important mini game, and it's of course gonna be an RNG mini game. I've had multiple people tell me that in this mini game, it's always opposite. If the cloud is on the pink the first time, it will always be blue the next time. So I am going to test that theory. I'm gonna go blue first. I'm going blue first. Figures. I think it's just wherever the fuck I'm standing. Okay, the theory, theory checks out so far. So 100% safe on blue now. Is that really how this mini game works? That is so stupid if that is actually how this minigame works. You know what else is stupid? Ian's gonna get fucking Germany before me. After all this planning out, I got screwed on the first one. How stupid. And now you lose with a five? Come on, dude! Whatever, man. This game is just so fucking funny, dude. It is, it's hilarious, dude. I am laughing. I am laughing right now. This is so, oh, it doesn't matter. Megan is getting there first, actually. She went all the way over there and then somehow managed to come all the way. Whatever, they just know how everything's gonna play out so they can perfectly navigate the world to get to where they need to go. I try to perfectly navigate the world and I get screwed. I get mugged in some freaking country. Well, Canada is eight spaces. Oh, eight, hey, look at that. Everything, everything might be all right. You can get all the way to Canada via helicopter from wherever the hell we were. 
This is the 10th round, so it's not over. If I get another hotspot card here, it's still not over. I have a guarantee to win. Mexico is four spaces, and my cards... Definitely, these aren't uh, four. I, I gotta use a balloon. Oh my god, I got eight. I'm going right to freaking Brazil. I'm gonna win. I I'm not a guaranteed win, but I'm... Like, the next closest thing to a guaranteed win here. The game... Wait. Oh, that's only three. We're definitely... We are definitely not guaranteed a win. Because if any of them get the last one, then I'm screwed. Yeah, never mind. No, I thought I was better off. For some reason, I thought I had four. Yeah, we're not... We're not guaranteed. We're not guaranteed by a long... That was an interesting... That was an interesting... Movement pattern by Megan. Megan doesn't have any money, though. So she can't even f afford Mexico. If she got there. Does Ian have two? No, he only has one, but he has a lot of coins. So if he got Mexico... If he got Mexico before me... He would still win. Because Mexico is about to be worth two. As this is going to overtime. And whoever gets Mexico gets two... Souvenirs. Ah! Oh, 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 I'm freaking trying to grab that. Oh man, that was close. Ian was going for it. It was Ian with the green hand. How far away is Mexico? Four. Shit. Well, we're just gonna end up one away. And I'm gonna have to hope to get my one card. If Ian here though, Gets a th Nah, he's still not gonna win. I have more coins than him, right? I have more coins than you. Ian, you might as well have not even got it. I have more coins than you. I think Ian just sabotaged the game. Wait, does it still cost him? Yeah, it does. I have more coins than that, right? Right? Yeah. Right? Megan with her sausage. Yep. <laughs> Screw you. Screw you, Ian! You thought you had it, but I had it more. 41? I only won by two coins. Didn't he have 39? Well, that was a lot closer than I thought. That was very tight titties. But very much so suckable. Well, that's that's standard difficulty. I thought for sure I was, I was going to lose that one, but... Hey, it, it just goes to show. You never know. You know? Losers can be winners. I'm done. Can I go back to main menu? Did I unlock spot the sneak? I didn't unlock knock the sneak. How do you even play spot the sneak? Where does it even come up at? I don't know. 